All right, here we go with round one. No denying the momentum that this young man brings to the table here tonight. He has won his last three fights, and if he wins a fourth one here tonight, he could just be staring at his first UFC title fight. If not, it might be a title eliminator, bottom line. You win a fourth straight fight here, you are getting a high-profile pay-per-view slot here in the UFC. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kick, he'll just pop a jab up. Getting the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is... Oh! Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this guy. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him. Oh. He's given him so many different things right now. He loaded up there on that high kick. Oh, straight right. Get the knees going. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. That is it! He got him! Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan.